shortly before midnight here at the Warsaw uh, Airport in Poland. This SAA chartered plane has been on this runway since just after one o'clock this afternoon. It's carrying a number of security personnel and uh, a crew of journalists who were meant to accompany President Cyril Ramaphosa to the Ukraine and Russia where he is currently uh, alongside five other heads of state uh, to um, go through some peace talks uh, with the leaders of both those countries. But as you can see here behind me, several containers carrying weapons uh, and other materials required by the police services are being held by Polish authorities, refusing to accept the paperwork to allow this shipment, these containers, uh, to travel onwards with security personnel who are on this plane. Yes, sir. One day tonight, for four hours to get in here, she was stood upset. It has never happened that we have stood upset anyone with a diplomatic passport just to get us out of here. Right? Now, they say um, we don't have permits. We have permits. The only difference is now they say we can't bring a copy of a permit. We must bring the original. Now, some of us have, have original permits. Right, the embassy um, here printed permits because I thought it's not necessary to, to have um, the originals here. Right? Now all of a sudden we must have originals. They are delaying us, right? They're putting out the life of our president in, um, in jeopardy because we could have been in Kiev um, this afternoon already right now an impasse as to what will happen uh, here this evening and whether this aircraft will have to turn around back to South Africa with all the personnel and the weaponry on board that was meant to protect the South African delegation during this peace mission to Ukraine and Russia. Reporting from Warsaw, Poland, I'm Lindsay Dentlinger.